Remember this also. Peter with Christ in him. It was the Christed Peter who got called out by Paul because Peter didn't want to eat with the non-Jews, which were the Gentiles. Because he was afraid of how the, these Jews would look at him. He was afraid of how they'd judge him. Oh, you're eating with them? So Peter, he still had that fleshly stuff that he had to battle. Even though he had Christ in him, even though he's a new covenant believer, even though he saw the working miracles of the Holy Spirit, he still did a naughty, naughty thing. Well, wouldn't that be blasphemy of the Holy Spirit to reject one of God's kids? You saw the works of Christ, Peter, and you still did wrong. You still tried to um, get the approval, approval of man, and now you are rejecting his children. You're saying you're above those children of God, the non-Jews, they're unclean to you. You know that Christ saved them too, Peter. You know it but you willfully reject it in public. Isn't that blasphemy of the Holy Spirit? Did Peter for commit the unforgivable sin? He's blaspheming, rejecting the Spirit of God. See, we worry about a lot of things as New Covenant believers. We worry about if we truly got saved in the first place. We worry about are we actually truly forgiven. We worry if we've committed some unforgivable sin because you read about an, an unforgivable sin in the Bible and you think you might have committed it. Peter received Christ, but maybe many times when you get caught up in your flesh, you seem to reject Christ. Well, your flesh, you think your flesh is the one that receives Christ? Is the one that accepts Christ? 